Hello, hello, Kenny Evans here, another car video. Topic of this video is when to listen to women. Before I get into that video topic, I'm gonna let y'all know this channel is all about both, well, helping both men and women be the best they can be in all aspects of their lives. Health, wealth, dating, relationship, and mindset. So, uh, welcome and thank you for being here. New people, returning people, welcome. Thank you for being here. Definitely, if you have not already done so, subscribe, hit that notification button so you'll be notified for whenever I upload some new videos. Of course, of course, of course, of course, you just want to help me out. My alg algorithm here of my channel, my video, definitely hit the like button and definitely do that if you just want to support me. And of course, share the video. Share the video so we can get this message out to more people who need it so we can make this world a better and more positive place for not only us, but our future generations. All right. So let us get back to the topic at hand. All right. When to listen to women. So I'm going to definitely uh, get into this because it is very important. A lot you got some guys who say don't ever listen to women some guys say always listen to women and of course there's a little bit uh, of reasons for both I'm gonna give you my reasons and when to uh, listen to women of course you want to have a little middle ground never say always never say never all right and I'm gonna give you all four reasons to or when to listen to women of course the bonus at the end it's gonna capture the everything very powerful so definitely want to stay to the end for the bonus all right so let us get into this topic when to listen to women first and foremost if they are your boss or your mother or some sort of authority figure essentially if they have the power to hurt you if you don't listen to them hurt your life then definitely listen and of course it's always to a certain extent you know what I mean? Just because your mother says something doesn't mean you got to always listen to everything. You're a grown person, grown man, grown woman, whoever. You definitely don't always have to listen if it goes against your principles. Of course, if you're living with your, your mother, your parents, you know what I mean? Do what you got to do to get out or do what you got to do within the, within the system to do what you got to do. But you don't always have to listen, especially if they're being disrespectful and negative to you. All right? Um, same with your boss, you know, obviously in theory and you know, for the most part you want to listen But if they say something that's disrespectful or Negative it's, it's crosses your line you could leave and I mean that's what happened to me. I was at uh, Burlington back in the day back in 2007 and I was working at uh, there and this female Female manager. She was miserable to me always negative um, my last straw was where she, she said over the PA that I wasn't working fast enough in my section and I got to get it done. And, you know, um, you know, pretty much that I was doing a bad job. And um, she'd always been negative, but she had never done anything like that to me. So I got my work done and I, I quit. I never came back. So, again, just because your boss or your manager says something who happens to be a female or male, doesn't matter, but doesn't mean you got to take it, you know, doesn't mean you got to take it. All right. So that's definitely one way uh, you want to be listening to women. Second, if something is life threatening, if they say, oh, man, I'm allergic to selfish, probably don't want to go to Red Lobster to eat. Sure. I'm sure they got a lot of different menus and different uh, options. Probably don't want to go there. You know what I mean? Um, or if someone, they say, a woman says they're afraid of heights or they deathly afraid of heights where they could be having a panic attack, they could faint, probably don't want to go to a roller coaster. You know what I mean? It's just the little things, you know, you just want to be able to listen to certain things that can save you heartaches and headaches. All right. Because as a strong man, you're responsible for not only you, but your woman, you know? So if you... Um, as a strong man, no, she has an issue that is life-threatening, potentially, and you still do it, then you're weak, you're insecure, and you got a big ego, and it is a problem that could uh, hurt you, you know? So, that is the second re 
reason to listen to women. Number three, this is very important. If you want a woman and she wants to leave you, keywords, if you want a woman. And she has so much value. Now she looks good. She takes care of herself. She's a constant pleasing, pleasing you. She wants to make you happy. She wants to be around you. She just loves you. She's just everything you want. But you do this thing. Maybe you play too many video games. You know. And you don't really spend too much time with her. She always has to come. And you're always playing the video games. And you know. It's like it just doesn't work for her. She's constantly saying. Hey. Cut off the video games. I want to spend some time with you. But she's like. I love the video games. I just love it. And it's like. Where it's not something that you're required to do. Like you don't have to play the video games. 15 hours a day. On the weekends but you just want to you know because you enjoy it and she says hey you playing the video games too much if you keep on playing the video games 15 hours a day I gotta leave you you know because you already work during the week and then when you're done playing the video games now you know you're tired you want to go to bed but I'm like dang where's my time you know she's like where's her time with you you know so and she said I gotta go because we just not spend enough time together you know, and again, it's not something that it, you are required to do that is like you just is non-negotiable. You could cut down on the video games because she has so much more value than you're just playing the video game. You know, she has so much more value to that and losing her would be a, a, a huge loss in your life. So you can cut down to keep her happy, spend more time with her and all that good stuff. All right. So thank y'all for making it this far in the video. If you have not already done so, if you're enjoying the video, definitely subscribe. Hit that notification button so be notified whenever I, well, you'll be notified whenever I upload some new videos. Definitely like, share the video. Let's get this uh, video out to more people who could use this message so we can make this world a much more positive and better place for us and our future generations. All right. Thank you. Fourth reason to listen to a woman. Definitely very important, um, and it may be a little confusing, but I will explain it, of course. If you don't want to see her again, all right, if a woman, let's say you approach a woman, and I get it, a little counterintuitive, but like I said, I'm going to explain it. If you approach a woman and she's negative to you, disrespectful, you just shut up and leave me alone. I think you want to shut up and leave her alone. Like, there's nothing good that can come, even if you can convert it. Like, that's a hard, 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 hard sell. You know what I mean? Like, you're going to have to be on your A game. And most guys can't do that. And it's, in the end, it's not worth it. There's going to be other women. So shut up and leave her alone. You know what I mean? If you're in a bad relationship, and again, it's kind of the same thing. The girl's constantly talking bad about you, being negative. You know, she said, I'm done. I'm tired of you. You're, you're, you're worthless. You're a piece of shit. I don't like you. I'm done. I'm leaving. And this has been for a long time. You're better off leaving, letting her go and starting over. Because at that point, she's unredeemable. She cannot be um, um, transformed into the woman you really need and want. So you got to let her go. Move forward. All right. So that is what I'm saying. If you don't want to see a woman again, essentially if she's negative and just disrespectful, let her go. If she says, hey, I don't want to see you, I don't want to talk to you, let her go, move forward. All right? Fourth reason you want to listen to a woman. All right? Thank you. We've made it this far to the bonus. We're at the end of the video. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for being here. Bonus is going to encapsulate, encapsulate everything. It's going to be very important. So definitely, I'm glad y'all are here. And essentially, it is listen to women whenever it's convenient to you or for you. That's the bottom line. Listen to women only when it's convenient for you. You know what I mean? Maybe you met a girl for the first time and, you know, you wanted to have sex, but she's like, oh, I'm on my period and like, yada, yada. And you're like, you don't really do the period sex. So she said, hey, I'll give you sex. I'll suck your dick. So, okay. That'd be cool. You're getting something. You know what I mean? You're getting something. All right? Um, or maybe she wants to, you know, 
uh, instead of an Xbox, you like Xbox, she said, I'll give you a PS5. The Xbox was sold out, been sold out for a long time. I'll give you a PS5. You know, whatever game counts or whatever it is. She gives you something that you will still enjoy, that will still be convenient to you. Whatever it is, even though um, it might not be the best, you'll still enjoy it and it'll still be a convenience. There'll be a convenience for you. So that is definitely when you want to listen to women in general, when it's convenient for you. All right? As a strong man. <laughs> all right? So that is all I got for y'all today. Thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for making it to the end of the video again. I like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button. So you'll be notified whenever I upload new videos. Share the video uh, so we can get this video out to more people who could use it. And of course... People who enjoy the video. All right. Um, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. This channel is not, it was made by me, but it's made for you. So let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. Of course, <clears throat> um, if you enjoy the video, donate. I appreciate donations. Donations are always very welcome. Thank you. I appreciate it. Only if you enjoy the video. Uh, they keep me motivated. They keep me going. So definitely do that. Uh, let me know what I missed. If you think I missed anything. If not, if you enjoyed the video, uh, uh, cool. Let me know in the comments respectfully. 